Um, then you have this idea that outer space should be used for the benefit and in the interests of all countries. Yes. And also that space should be the province of all mankind. Okay. Now, in, in more gender enlightened times, that could be the province of all humanity. You, you, yeah, yeah, exactly. Um, it begs a question about if, outer, if the use and exploration of outer space is the province of all humanity, who represents mm. all humanity? Yes. Um, now, you could say, well, states do when they come together in the United Nations. Um, there's several reasons why you might be cynical about yep. that, but there's there's no body that says I am the whole you, yeah, of humanity. I represent humanity. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yes. yeah. Yes. Okay. So it's it's difficult to know how to give that, uh, implement that, or give that manifestation, if you like. Mm, okay. Um, All right. And it potentially has implications for, for example, the um, space resource yes. utilization. Um, and, and, how, and, and, and for the benefit of interests of all countries, how space resources have to be used, for okay. example. So it has implications for that. And this is, this is indicative of a lot of the um, articles of the Outer Space Treaty in that it's, it's expressed in very broad terms. It doesn't give you a lot of specifics. It gives you broad principles. What, was this intentional? It is somewhat. Yeah. Um, it, it's, it's difficult to negotiate a treaty that, that has lots of specifics in it, especially when you're trying to be forward thinking. Yeah, 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 exactly. The space treaty was. Yeah, and I mean, in fact, I think there's, there's already issues that we're seeing, even though it was as broad as it is, it's still ill-defined in some ways in a very specific, yeah. You're trying to predict what the technology is going to allow you to do, but you don't know what it's going to allow you to do. Right. So you can't say, yeah. If they said space starts at 100 kilometers, for instance, well, then if you did something at 99 kilometers, you're like, oh, not space, right? right? And, right. you know, um, <laughs> not applicable, but... Yes, and those, yeah. those states who say it's too early to, to settle on a delimitation, that's part of the argument that they make, is yeah. that technology changes, mm. and so um, we don't need to settle a definition or a delimitation just yet. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, um, and, uh, sorry, and, and this is an important way of thinking about the importance of, uh, of, of this. So the idea here is how do you characterize um, the use of any good uh, and uh, including goods in outer space? So on the one hand, there's a question of whether you can exclude people from the use of a good. Okay. Uh, and on the other hand, there's a question of whether your use um, subtracts from or, or prevents the enjoyment of the use of that good by somebody else. So on the one hand, if you're, you're talking about food, if I eat the food, yeah. then somebody else can't eat it. Right. It's yeah. subtractable. Yeah, fair right? enough. Yeah, okay. Um, and I can exclude somebody else from, from, yes. from yeah, okay. you yep. know, eating, That's eating right. that food. Same with something like a parking space or a slot in geosynchronous yes. Earth orbit. Yes. For example. So you're saying, so yes, yeah, so that very specific orbit, you're saying by me taking it, because it has to be in this very, really defined, very small window, I'm now excluding someone else from taking that spot. Right. Okay. Right. Right. Interesting. But then you have uh, goods that are you can't exclude people from, but your use of it does subtract from the use of it by others. Okay. All right. So fish stocks, for yeah, example. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's hard to exclude other people from accessing fish stocks, but yeah. if you take the fish... And you take then, a lot of it, it doesn't leave a lot for other people. It subtracts from the use by others. This is similar with frequency. You can't exclude people from accessing signals, yep. but uh, if you use that signal and that frequency, potentially you're going to jam and make it difficult for somebody else to use that frequency. So could you make the argument for low Earth orbit here? You know, low Earth orbit obviously has a much bigger range than, say, geostationary orbit. So if you take a lot of the slots, do you remove the access for more people? Could you make that argument? Potentially, yeah. potentially. And, and, and we'll talk about that in respect of regulating congestion yeah, and doing yeah, space yeah. traffic okay. management. Yeah, okay, all right. It, it becomes relevant. So understanding yeah, yeah. this sort of thing is, is relevant for, for that. Then you have goods where you can exclude others, but your use doesn't subtract from the use by others. So for example, um, 
you have to have a, a ticket to go to the cinema, mm -hmm. um, but um, you know many people can go to the cinema, and the fact that you happen to have a ticket doesn't exclude yeah, others from okay. going okay. to right. the cinema. Yep. Same with satellite television or um, military GPS. You mm. can exclude others from using military GPS, but you can make it available to however many allies and companies yeah, and yeah. as okay. you like. Yep. Okay. I see. But on the other hand, civilian GPS. Yes. Um, it's not excludable. It's anybody can use it, and your use doesn't subtract from anybody else's exactly. use of it. That's right. That's right. So the, you can build more. More people can use them. And there's, so there's a lot of these cases in space. It seems like where it's not that the supply is infinite, but yeah, you're not deduct deducting or preventing someone else from doing that same thing. Right. Right. Yeah. Okay. And 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 your particular field, astronomy, yeah. for example. Um, anybody can can do astronomy. Yeah, yeah. And and the fact that you are looking up into the night sky doesn't prevent someone else from doing yes. it. Yes, exactly. Okay.